Okay, here's the unboxing of my Philips Norelco Shaver 5300. It's pretty basic. It just comes with a charger. It says when it's flashing, it means it's charging. When all three of those lights just stay lit up, it means it's charged. It comes with a plastic cover and a brush. It says to shave in circular motions to get all the hairs growing in different directions. It does not say how long it is supposed to charge but I'll be back when it's charged to show you how good it is. The Philips Norelco Shaver 5300. Show you how good it does. <laughs> Um, not bad. I'm a little surprised. I'm not a fan of rotary shavers. I can feel a little bit of stubble. Probably have to go over it one more time. It's kind of hard to get as close of a shave as with the uh, flat blade razor anyways. But uh, I'm going to switch over and do my the other side of my face with my uh, foil. I think it's a Panasonic Arc 3 razor that I usually use when I use an electric one because I like rotary shavers better. And then I'll compare. Then I was going to show you real quick how much, uh, it really didn't accumulate too much, so it's definitely convenient with the flip top. It was a very comfortable shave, um, I did forget to say that. Um, it's definitely got a lot of flex in these as you can see for contours. Um, it's definitely worth buying, I just want to switch over and compare it to my uh, foil shaver real quick. Okay, here's my uh, Panasonic Arc 3. They're about the same. Uh, I like my foil razor uh, shaver better because you can push down really hard and it's got a long wide track that stays firm instead of all that flexible stuff. Um, I feel like with the flexible stuff, if you push down hard, the point of impact is just like a smaller circle because uh, it doesn't like push all the way down against the razor. You can get more torque with the foil razor. But uh, the, the Panasonic 530 shaver, um, if you like rotary shavers better, I would definitely buy that one. It's definitely a safe buy. Here's the Panasonic 5300 shaver on Amazon. I like to look at the reviews on Amazon, even when I'm not buying something. So if you click on the ratings, it's got quite a few ratings. Still 4.5 out of 5 stars, so uh, that's pretty good. It's hard to beat that. Uh, right away it says, gives a great shave, very smooth and quiet. It was a lot quieter. Right here it says much better than the Arc. Which is the one I compared it to, but my arc was a foil shaver, so it does make a difference. I don't really care about noise when I'm shaving. Uh, more noise just feels like more power to me. But uh, to each their own, it's definitely a comfortable, quiet razor. Not great at shaving just below your nose. Most razors aren't, though. That's pretty common sense, so that doesn't mean much to me. But anyways, nothing but five stars. But when I do look at the reviews, I like to go up here to... To sort the reviews, it's sorted by top reviews, so I like to switch over and go to most recent. So right away it says bad. Uh, poor job of shaving. Um, it's probably just somebody that's not used to the rotary shavers, because it is really good for a rotary shaver. Um, good price. Broken after three uses, don't buy. So it might be bad on durability. Um, anyways, if you scroll down, most recent it. It's got some bad reviews right away, which isn't a, the greatest sign. Um, it says right here, it did not, sh I think they meant to say shave as well as some of them was sharp enough to do the job on Happy With Product. I just tried it out, it definitely gets the job done as far as uh, being sharp enough to shave. Just have to be familiar with rotary shavers. Wet dry shaver works best as wet shaver with gel or cream. 
broke after three months. So, looks like durability might be an issue. Wait, I um, don't see anything else popping up. Second one, the first lasted 20 years. That's a good sign. Um, anyways, it's a pretty safe buy. It is. How much did it cost? How much does it cost on Amazon? 89.99. Let me look up my pen. Uh, let's see. It was a mine's a Panasonic Arc 3, I believe. Sonic Arc 3 shaver. The Panasonic Arc 3 shaver is here. It is. This is the kind that I have. The colors and all that. Ooh, mine's actually 103.99, so I would definitely go with the uh, the uh, Philips Neurocode 5300. Uh, if you wanted to save a little bit of money, uh, if you like uh, rotary shavers, if you like a foil shaver, I would go with the Panasonic Arc ones. You could probably find a cheaper one on here. That one comes with adjustable trim attachments. Oh, let me see if there's a cheaper Arc 3. Here's an Arc 3 electric razor for 89 about the same price. Here's Amazon's Choice, 99.99. So um, they're about the same. Um, it's definitely a safe buy, but if you want a foil razor, go with the Arc 3.